Hello everyone, myself Sai Prasad, Alexan, Akhlabath High School and the Junior College. Welcome to a series of the lectures of Intermediate Second Year Maths B. We have started our discussion with the chapter Circles. What did we learn? We learned the basics of what is a circle equation, then how do we find the center, radius from different forms. And we also we could find a few few problems of uh, finding center, radius if there is some missing variable. Okay? Those are a basic problems. From now, we are going to start how do we find the equation of a circle? Okay? How do we find? Okay? He gave three points. He is asking to find the equation of a circle passing through these three points. How do we find? Shall we start? See here, this is, a, this is a basic and standard form to find the equation of a circle for all the questions and this is a very important long answer question. Shall we start? See here. The first thing we have to do is, we have to assume a equation x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equal to 0 be required circle. Okay? Let us say this as equation 1. Fine. He gave 3 points and he is telling that these three points passing through this equation. So, what we have to do is first substitute one one point in it. So, let us write given 3 comma 4 passes through equation 1. What happens? We have to substitute this point in this equation. Therefore, that will be 3 square 9. 4 square 16, 2 into g into 3, 2 3 is a 6 g, 2 into f into y, y is 4 that is 8 f plus c equal to 0. This will be, let us put all g f c on left side and send this constant right side. That will be 6 g plus 8 f plus c, 6 plus 19 is minus 25. Let us consider it as equation 2. Clear? Fine. Next, uh, let us take second point, fine, that will be 3 comma 2 passes through equation 1, okay. So, let us write now what it will be 3 square is 9, 2 square is 4, if I substitute 3 in this place, 2 3 is a 60. If I substitute 2 here, it will be 4f plus c equal to 0. Do not get confused, check properly. 3 and 2, 3 2s are 6, 2 2s are 4. This will be 6g plus 4f plus c equal to 9 plus 4 is minus 13. This is third equation. Clear? Good. Next, the third thing, third point, 1 comma 4 passes through 1. Therefore, that will be 1 plus 16, right, 4 square plus 2 into 1 is 2g plus 4 to the 8f plus c equal to 0. This will be 2g plus 8f plus c is equal to 16 plus 1 is minus 17. Let us say this as fourth equation. Okay? Now, we have to solve this three equation in order to find the values of g, f, c. That is our main task. Okay? Follow the standard form. What do I do is, I will subtract 2 and 3 first. 2, 3. Okay? Why do I subtract? Because we can cancel c so easily. Okay? Now, say here this will be 6g plus 8f plus c equal to minus 25. Here, 6g plus 4f plus c is equal to minus 13. Okay? Unfortunately, we can cancel both the terms here. 6g, 6g, cc will get cancelled. Actually, we will never get uh, those kind of things. 8f minus 4f is, here I will get 8 minus 4 as 4f and here uh, plus 13 minus 25, this is minus 12. I will get it as 4 1s are 4 3s are that is minus 3. Clear? That is, we have subtracted second and third. So, let us find, I mean, let us do the same thing for 3 and 4. Let us subtract 3 and 4. What do we get? 6g plus 4f plus c is equal to minus 13 and 
2g plus 8f plus c is equal to minus 17. Clear? Subtract. I will get it as 6g minus 2g is 4f, 4g. 4 minus 8 is minus 4f. Cc will however get cancelled. 17 minus 13 is 4. Clear? Now let us take 4 common. I will get it as g minus f is equal to 4. g minus f is 1. Right? f is minus 3. If I substitute in this, I will get it as minus 2 minus plus 3 equal to 1. I will get as uh, what is this? Uh, before that, let us take this as equation number 5 and equation number 6. Now, uh, in all the questions, whatever we do, we always get uh, one more equation here, but unfortunately, these both got cancelled. So, we will solve again 5 and 6. Here also, let us write substitute f equal to minus 3 in 6 or simply we can write it as substitute 5 in 6. So, what do we get? g minus of minus 3 is equal to 1 that is g plus 3 is equal to 1 therefore g is minus 2. Clear? We got the value of f, we got the value of g. Let us substitute in the equation 2. Substitute g f in 2. What do we get? 6 into I mean uh, 6 into minus 2 plus 8 into minus 3 plus c is equal to minus 25. What do we get? Minus 12 minus 24 plus c is equal to minus 25. Okay. My, I mean if this 24 come this side that will be uh, 24 minus 25 that is minus 1. If this 12 go that way, I will get it as 11. Is it clear? So, let us substitute all these things in this standard equation. Okay substitute g f c in 1. What do we get? x square plus y square plus 2 into g into x 2 into f into y plus 3 11 c is equal to 0. What is c? 11. Okay? So, let us simplify it. This will be x square plus y square minus 4 x minus 6 y plus 11 equal to 0. This is a required circle. Clear? Once again let me tell. He is asking us to find the equation of circle passing through those three points. Okay? Then what did we do? We took this as a standard equation be the required circle. Then I have named it as equation 1. First point passing through the substituting you will get an equation. Second point passing through the same equation you will get one more equation. Like that we will get three equations. Subtracting 2 minus 3, 3 minus 4. We will get two equations in terms of g and f. Again, solving those two equations, I, I will always name it as 5 and 6. Solving those two, we will get the values of g, f. Substituting in this, we will get c. Substituting in the first equation, we will get the final equation of a circle. Clear? Do you understand? There is a basic question. If you understand this only, we can move to the further question. Clear? Fine. Let us move on to the next question. Look at the next question here. This is the same question which we did. Find the equation of a circle passing through these three points. How do we do? That is again the same. We will first assume let x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equal to 0 be required circle. Is not it? So, let us take this as equation number 1. Let us substitute one after the other point. Given 1 comma 2 passes through 1. Then what do I get? 1 plus 4 plus 2g plus 4y equal to 0. Then I get 2g plus here it is 4f plus c is equal to minus 5. This is equation 2. Clear? Check again and again. 1 plus 4 plus 2g plus 4f plus c equal to 0. Next. Similarly, 3 comma minus 4 passes through 1. Okay? Now, let us substitute 3 comma minus 4 is 9 plus 16 plus substitute 3 here 3 to the 
6x substitute 4 here 4 to the 8 I mean 6g 8f plus c is equal to 0 then I get 6g minus 8f plus c is equal to minus 25 this is my equation 3 clear check again 3 square plus 4 square 2 3 is a 6 4 2 is a 8 next third point 5 comma minus 6 passes through 1 what do I get 25 plus 36 5 2 is a 10 g 6 2 is a 12 f plus c equal to 0 then I get 10 g minus 12 f plus c is equal to 36 plus 25 how much is it 5 plus 6 is 11 3 plus 1 is 60 minus 61 this is equation 4 clear b checking every time 5 plus 6 is 11 2 plus 3 is 5 plus 1 60 Okay. The next step, what is that? We have to subtract second and third equations. 2 minus 3. What is 2? 2, 2g plus 4f plus c equal to minus 5. Here, 6g minus 8f plus c is equal to minus 25. So, if I subtract minus plus minus plus, these both will get cancelled. 2 minus 6 is minus 4g. 8 plus 4 is 12f. 25 minus 5 is 20. Let us take minus 4 common. What do I get? G minus 3f is equal to 20. Therefore, I will get the equation as G minus 3f is equal to 4 1s are 4 5s are. If this 5 comes this side, this will be plus 5 is equal to 0. This is my equation number 5. Is it right? Good. So, uh, let us do 3 minus 4. What is 3? 6g minus 8f plus c is equal to minus 25. Fourth equation is 10g minus 12f plus c is equal to minus 61. So, let us subtract it. I will get it as c c will get cancelled. 6 minus 10 is minus 4g. Okay. Here 12 minus 8 is 4f. Okay. And the next 61 minus 25, how much is that? Obviously, 36. So, let me take minus 4 common, I will get it as g minus f is equal to 36, 4 1s are 4 9s. I will get g minus f plus 9 is equal to 0. This is equation number 6. So, we have to solve this 5 and 6. You can solve in any method. As of now, for this problem, we can solve in this elimination method or else let us do our standard form that is cross multiplication method. How do we do minus 3, 5, 1, minus 3. Here minus 1, 9, 1, minus 1, minus 1, 9, 1, minus 1. Here minus 3, 5, 1, minus 3. Okay? That will be g f 1. Therefore, g by this uh, uh, any form it is okay minus 5 plus 27 f by 9 minus 5 1 by minus 3 plus 1 okay here it is minus 5 plus 27 9 minus 5 minus 3 plus 1 clear therefore i will get g as 27 minus 5 22 22 by minus 2 f is 9 minus 5 is 4 by minus 2. Therefore, g is minus 11, f is minus 2. Let us substitute g and f in this second equation. What do I get? I will get it as 2 into minus 11 okay? and the next 4 into minus 2 plus c is equal to minus 5. Okay? 2 into minus 11, 4 into minus 2 plus c equal to minus 5. Minus 22 minus 8 plus c is equal to minus 5. This is minus 30, 30 minus 5 is 25. I got the value of C, G and F. Let us substitute everything in first equation. Substitute G, F, C in 1. Therefore, equation is x square plus y square plus 2 into minus 11 into x, 2 into F into y 
plus 25 equal to 0. Therefore, equation is x square plus y square minus 22 x minus 4 y plus 25 is equal to 0. Is it okay? What did we do in this uh, problem? Again, taking assuming the first uh, standardized equation, substituting first point, second point, third point, we will get 3 equation, 2 minus 3, 3 minus 4. After that, we will get fifth and sixth equation. Solving those 5 and 6, we will get gf. Substituting in any one of the equation, we will get c. Substituting all gfs in 1. Clear? Is it okay here? Shall we move on to the next problem? Let's do. Look at the next quick, uh, question now. He gave, find the equation of a circle passing through these two points and having a center of this line it seems. Okay. So, what is the first step? The same thing. That is, let us assume x square plus y square plus 2 g x plus 2 f y plus c equal to 0 be required circle. Okay, let us take it as equation 1. So, he is telling these uh, this equation passes through those two points. So, let us substitute it first that is 4 comma 1 passes through 1. What do we get? Substitute it in. 4 square is 16, 1, 4 to the 8 g plus 2 f plus c equal to 0. That will be 8 g plus 2 f plus c is equal to minus 17. Okay. Similarly, the second point 6 comma 5, 6 comma 5 passes through 1. What do we get? 36 plus 25 plus 6 to the 12 g, 5 to the 10 f plus c equal to 0. That will be 12 g plus 10 f plus c is equal to 36 plus 25. How much is it? 61 minus 61. Clear? This is how we got two equations. Check again. 4 comma 1. What do we get? 16 plus 1 plus 4 to the 8 g plus 2 1s are 2 plus c equal to 0. Similarly, 6 comma 5 substitute we will get uh, 36 plus 25 plus 2 6 are 12 and 2 5 is 10 f plus c equal to 0. Done? Fine. Then he is telling that the center passes through this point. What is the center of this equation? Minus g minus f. So, it passes through this equation given that given center minus g minus f passes through which equation 4 x plus y minus 16 equal to 0. Then we will get it as minus 4 g minus into minus plus I mean here it is minus f minus 16 is equal to 0. This is my fourth equation. Clear? What is our next step? Subtracting 2, 3. So, what is that we have to do is 2 minus 3. Then we get 8g plus 2f plus c is equal to minus 17. Here 12g plus 10f minus plus c is equal to minus 61. Subtract. Okay. 8 minus 12 is minus 4g. Okay. 2 minus 10 is minus 8f, these both will get cancelled, 61 minus uh, 17, how much? 61, 41, 44, clear? Here it is plus. Let us take minus 4 common, I will get it as g minus g plus 2f, I will get it as g plus 2f, 4 ones are 4 11 are. Let me take this minus 11, that will become this. So, it will be equation number 5. Clear? And next we have to subtract 3 minus 4. However, there is no c term. So, we will directly, we can directly solve this 4 and 5. Now, solve 4 and 5. Okay? This will be, uh, let me take minus common here. I will get it as 4 g plus f plus 16 is equal to 0. Let us write 1, 16, 4, 1. Here 2, 11, 1, 2. 
okay 1 16 4 1 here 2 11 1 2 clear this will be g f 1 g by 11 minus I mean uh, 32 minus 11 f by 44 minus 16 1 by 1 minus 8 okay 32 minus 11 44 minus 16 1 minus 8 g by uh, here 32 minus 11 how much is it tell me 32 minus 11 is 21 here f by 44 minus 16 how much it will be 28 yes 1 by minus 7 what is g here therefore we will directly get g as 21 by minus 7 f as 28 by minus 7 g is minus 3 f is minus 4 then let us substitute g f in uh, this equation substitute g f in 2 I will get it as 8 g plus 2 f plus c is equal to minus 17 what do I get minus 24 minus 8 plus c is equal to minus 17 minus 24 minus 8 is minus 32 plus c is minus 17 c is 32 minus 17 how much do we get tell me here it is 15 clear let us substitute all values in our first equation substitute g f c n 1 then I will get it as x square plus y square 2 g x minus 6 x 2 f y minus 8 y plus 15 is equal to 0 this is my required equation is it clear what all problems we did today we started with the finding the equation when three points are given we did two problems of those kind and here they gave two points and he is telling that center on this third equation okay this is common this uh, uh, we will assume an equation to be a required cycle substituting first equation will get an equation substituting second point will get one more equation and he is telling that the center passes through this therefore minus g minus f passes through this will get one more equation 2 minus 3 will get fifth one solving 5 and 4 will get the values of g and f substituting g f in any one of the equation will get the value of c substituting g f c in 1 will get the required equation clear did you understand fine uh, hope everything is clear for today ok good this is for today let us meet in the next session with the more problems of circles thank you